St. Lucia's medical practitioners will benefit from Prime Minister Honorable Philip J. Pierre's newly instituted value-added tax exemption policy on medical equipment. Prime Minister Pierre's VAT amnesty on medical equipment will incentivize doctors in private practice to procure imported medical equipment at reduced costs. Local doctors can expand their offerings to their clients at more affordable rates. So the medical fraternity, fraternity can import these materials and pay no VAT and no health and security levy. Mr. Speaker, what better statement that a government can make to support health services in the country, Mr. Speaker? And that decision was not made lightly because th there were some, some who said to us, some said to, to the Minister of Finance, these, these people can afford to bring that equipment because they charge to use it. But the government sought no. We sought no that we have to give them added incentive, Mr. Speaker. So the people who travel all the time, who have to go, have to pay the passage, who have to come and we hoping that the medical fraternity can invest in these machines and can do the tests necessary for the people of Salusha, Mr. Speaker. Prime Minister Pierre's VAT amnesty on medical equipment dovetails with the government's thrust towards universal health care coverage and strengthening St. Lucia's national health infrastructure. The two-year VAT amnesty will increase the domestic availability of radiological and clinical examinations, avoiding St. Lucia's costly travel expenses to overseas countries. Increased access to these medical services can improve the detection of illness in patients who would not have been able to afford it before the VAT amnesty. The government by itself can never establish this medical lands landscape. Can never, go no government by itself can do it. So we must work with the private sector, the medical professionals, um, those who are in, in, in medical, in the businesses, the, the people who make equipment and so on. What we want is, is for St. Lucians, first and foremost, to have the best medical care at an affordable price. So whatever we can do as a government, with taxes, whatever we can do to assist the private sector, we will do. Prime Minister Pierre's VAT amnesty on medical equipment will bring down the cost of vital medical exams. Wider availability of medical services at more affordable rates will save St. Lucian's money and improve their health. The Parliament recently voted to pass a resolution introduced by the Prime Minister to remove VAT charges on a suite of radiological and clinical equipment for two years, commencing August 2, 2023 to August 1, 2025. From the Office of the Prime Minister, Rihani Isidore.